What's up everybody? Well, welcome to another edition of the friendly forum of the HVAC YouTube land. Um, you know, with spring coming up, I kind of want to throw out there about the, uh, you know, what, what kind of coil cleaners do y'all use? Uh, I've, you know, I personally use the um, foamy coil cleaner by Diversitech, or actually by Ace, I'm sorry. Diversitech makes a foamy coil cleaner. Um, a, AKA root beer. Uh, I've heard guys use New Bright and say that that's all they'll ever use. They love it. Uh, personally, I've used them all. And I always just go back to the root beer stuff uh, because it's what works good for me. And um, I do use the uh, eco friendly uh, Triple D by, the, by Diversitech. Um, uh, they came out and said that. That by us using uh, the real harsh coil cleaners, that it pits the aluminum coils, or it pits the aluminum fins on the coils, um, and and it only makes it easier for the fins to collect more dust and, and dirt. And uh, so I use both of them. If I come up on a really bad coil, then I'm going to use uh, what's going to get the dirt out. And if I'm just doing a maintenance, hell, sometimes if I've been there multiple years, I'm just going to use a water hose and just spray out the dirt, you know, just spray out the coal. Um, because if you're doing a maintenance every year, you don't really need to do uh, uh, a, a coal cleaning with, with a cleaner. Uh, water works just fine. And if you can get the homeowner... Uh, to spray out the coal every once in a while. That's even better. Uh, it only helps them uh, in the end, so why wouldn't they do it? But then there's some homeowners that just won't. Uh, so that being said, and, and when you when you do clean the coal, are you using a coal gun or are you using a pump-up sprayer? I personally use a pump-up sprayer. I have used a coal gun. Uh, John Israel sent me one. Uh, I don't like it. Uh, and the reason I don't like it is because I use too much coil cleaner and uh, uh, It gets about as much miles per gallon as my truck does in my opinion uh, Now I know there's guys out there that love them uh, I just personally like to pump up sprayer because I can you know uh, Not conserve on on coil cleaner, but I just don't use as much um, You know so that that's just me but um and and you know here I'm going to talk about something else uh, that's that's you know a little off subject but you know it's going to go back to doing the YouTube videos uh, you know there's plenty of guys out there that are posting YouTube videos that really don't need to be and I'm going to put a link in the description of a video that you really need to go watch uh, and this guy really has no business of working on the air conditioner. I mean, he just doesn't. He's a handyman, and he's not posting the videos for views. Uh, he's uh, uh, posting them for uh, the homeowners that he's doing work for. And watching the video, if you pay attention, he keeps talking about a guy named Nick. Well, while I, while I was watching the video, I thought he was actually uh, sending the video to our buddy Nick at NLB Heating and Air. Uh, because he kept saying, you know, he kept talking about Nick. Uh, but in the end, I found out that it was uh, the homeowner that this guy does work for. And there actually is a part two of that video. Uh, you just have to go over to his channel. And uh, I think the title is, uh, the air condition is, is, is working. Uh, so anyway, go watch that video. It, it's, it's, it is a video of, of a guy that really has no business working on heating and air. Uh, so with that being said and another one I want to throw a shout out to my buddy Harry Dixon uh, This guy he's uh, st uh, He he started watching our videos because he made a video and and because of Google Plus I was able to read a comment from a guy that that Saw his video and left him a comment and and it wasn't a nice comment And then I threw my two cents in on the comment and then he finally you know um, uh, he said he was going to be making these videos and that he would uh, and I said well send me a link to it 
So he sent me a link to the next one, and 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 it was funny. It was a funny video. So I uh, so I subscribed to the guy, and and um, you know he, he he's a funny guy. Uh, he doesn't mean any harm by what he's doing. Uh, so go over and, and click on Harry Dixon's video and watch it. I know uh, uh, he he had some stuff stirred up about what one of his videos, what he was doing. But, you know, in the end, it, it, it is all about entertaining people. So I say thumbs up to my buddy Harry. Uh, I'll put a link to his description. To I'll put... In the description, I'll put a link to his videos. Uh, if you want to go watch them, go check them out. I enjoyed them myself. I know some other guys have, have watched them and enjoyed them. Uh, so go watch Harry Dixon's videos. Go watch the guy who doesn't need to be working on, on air conditioning. Um, you know, we can't leave comments because he's disabled them. But, so I decided since I couldn't comment, I'm just going to make a video about it. So go watch that guy. Uh, come back tell me what you think uh, I'm sure you will be impressed by his skills anyway thanks for tuning in to this edition of the HVAC friendly forum tell me what kind of coil cleaners you use uh, uh, and why you don't use certain ones go check those videos out uh, and enjoy your day till then I'll talk to you later bye